Whoa, look, guys. Hold on, just hold on. Look. A magical crystal, oh. A magical crystal bubble ball. Welcome to Ryan's Family Review. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Happy Halloween. Today, I thought we could have fun with dry ice. For example, look at this pumpkin here. <laughs> All we need to do is add water inside the pumpkin. Next, wear your goggles. Then, get some dry ice with the tongs. You guys hear that noise? It squeaks. Now let's put it in. All right, here, let's watch some magic. Happens. Wow. Now we're going to do other fun science experiment using dry ice. First fun science experiment with dry ice. You're going to need a container, fill it halfway with warm water, like so. Then get some Dawn soap, put about two spoonful of it. One, into a small glass of water. Two, and then you're gonna agitate. Find a cloth strip like this. Soak it in your Dawn liquid water soapy like that. Pull it out and take away the excess soapy water. Next, add some dry ice. Whoa! <laughs> Use your string of soapiness and try to run it over the rim like so. Oh, there it is. Whoa, look guys. Hold on, just hold on. Look. A magical crystal, oh. A magical crystal bubble ball. Feels like I have magical power. Let's see how long it'll go before it pops. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that's so cool! Did you guys see that? Let's try that again. Look! Okay, guys. Watch! Oh, do you want me to read your fortune? Oh. So cool. So that is dry ice experiment number uno. Okay guys, so this is dry ice experiment number two. You're gonna need some graduated cylinder. Fill it up with 400 milliliters of water. All right, keep filling. Keep filling. Next, you're gonna get some universal indicator. So drop about a teaspoon of it into your water. All right, so once you add universal indicator, you see that it changes from a clear to a green. And then you gotta just mix it up. So a universal indicator will change a substance different color depending on if it's an acid or a base. So let's see what happens when you add in some dry ice. So first it's green. See the magic happen. Whoa! Now it changed to orange. Wow! That is so cool. So the dry ice produces carbonic acid. Since it's an acid, it lowers down the pH and then it changes color. That is amazing. So what will happen if you add a base to it? So I got some household ammonia. I'm gonna try it out, okay? So ammonia is a base. Okay, let's see what happens when I add in the universal indicator. Okay, so you see how it's starting to turn yellow? 
Okay, so I'm just agitating, mixing it in. So yeah, it comes down green, but then because it touches the base, it just changed to yellow right away. Okay, let's see what happens when I add in the dried ice, okay? So this is without ammonia, and this is with. Oh, so what did you notice happened? It didn't change to this color. Okay, here's science experiment number three with dry ice. First, you're gonna get a giant container. Drill a hole like this if you can. Find a tube. Connect it together. I didn't make mine, I actually bought it online. Okay, so put this in. Next, you're gonna get warm water and fill it one fourth way, okay? Next, get some soapy water, okay, like in the first experiment. Then add in some dry ice. Here we go. Whoa. Get a lid, close it. Now, it just comes out of here. Woo Next, dip this end of the hole into the liquid. And look what happened! Whoa, do you guys see? Whoa, do you guys see how it just breaks? Here we go, here's one. Look, look at, look at, it goes on the table. <laughs> Little boo bubbles. Whoa, did you know you could also hold the boo bubble? Let's see. Look, I held my old boo bubbles. So I can transfer it over. Oh, I can't. Oh, let's try that again. There we go. All right, my boo bubble. Whoa, did you guys see that? Okay. Oh, oh it break. Okay, let's try that again. Boo bubbles. Here we go. Oh. Oh. All right, so that's how you play and make your own cute little boo. Bubbles! Okay guys, experiment number four with dry ice. Get a canister. Next, find a piece of dry ice. Put it inside. Close the lid. Okay, and then move back and watch. Any second now, it's going to explode your mind, okay? Or at least explode the canister. Guys, safety first, okay? All right. Hello. Hello. Okay, any minute now. Did you guys see that? Okay, guys, we're gonna be more adventurous and do it with three, okay? Which one going to pop first? Dry ice number one, dry ice number two, dry ice number three. There you go. All right. Close the lid. One, two, three. Okay, stand back. All right, guys. Any minute now. Oh, one, two more to go. Two. Okay, you're the last one. Three. Whoa, that is so cool. So that is experiment number four. Experiment number five, we're gonna make some eerie glowing bubbles. So first, get a graduate cylinder, fill it halfway with water, get some atomic glow, add a few drops in. Okay. Woohoo! Look. Wow. We're gonna just stir it a little bit. Wow. Let's see what it looks like in a black light. Got my black lights here, turn it on, turn the light off. There, now let's take a look. Look how it glows. Wow. Next, add a squirt of Dawn soap inside. There it is. Next, let's add in some dry ice. Don't use your hands, I have gloves on. All right, the magic happens. Whoa, look how it foams out. Whoa. Whoa. 
Oh, that is cool. You know what's even more cool? Adding in a glow stick. First, break it. Whoa! Look at it glow. Okay, we're gonna turn on back the lights, okay? So you can see what's happening. There it is, look how it's foaming out. Whoa. Wow. Let's see if adding a glow stick will help, okay? All right, bye bye glow stick. All right, so that's with the glow stick. It's helping a little bit, whoa. And that, you guys, is experiment number five. There it is, you guys. Top five fun Halloween science experiment with dry ice. Now let's end the video with some more dry ice. Remember, don't use your hands. I have gloves on. All right, a whole bunch of dry ice in here. Woohoo! <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys like this video. If you do, give us a big thumbs up and let us know which one of those five experiments did you guys like the most. For now, bye. <laughs> Have a fantastic day. Don't forget to subscribe for